Hey y'all, this your girl Keish. Welcome back to the Keish TV. And if you are new to my channel, welcome to the Keish TV. I hope you enjoy yourself here with me today. Today I am making um some keto keto friendly enchiladas. And what I have today, my ingredients consist of some pepper and onion blend, some uh mild red enchilada sauce, some medium red enchilada sauce, some uh, squeezed garlic, garlic powder, nature seasoning, onion powder, some ground beef, 80-20, some uh, chopped up green onions for my cheese. I have mild cheddar. I have mozzarella, whole milk. I have some quesadilla, shredded cheese, and I have some pepper jack cheese. I also have um, some deli fresh honey smoked turkey breast, which I was trying to just get oven roasted turkey breast, but that's what they sent me. So that's what I got. So anyway, I'm going to go in on and I'm going to jump into, I'm going to do my ground meat, cook that up, chop up the peppers and everything. I'm going to come back and show you guys when I start to do, actually do the, um, do the enchiladas. Because I don't want this video to be too long. I just want it to be a little short, quick video. But y'all know how to cook up ground beef and put the peppers and onions and stuff in there and everything. Because right now I'm watching my girl Nene eat, you know. And um, so I'm going to be back when it's time to start actually assembling my enchiladas. All right, y'all. I just wanted to come back and show y'all uh, what this looking like. Then I'm going to drain it because even though, you know, you want fat, you know, in keto meals, <laughs> that's a little too much for me, you hear me? At the same time, I've already put my seasonings in there, so I just wanted to come show y'all that. <laughs> then I'm going to be doing my, um, the, uh, what is that, the sauce. I'm not going to put the sauce in here. I'm going to put that on the side because this is going to go on top. The sauce is going to go on top. And whatever is left, you know, is going to go on top of it. Be back. All right, y'all. And uh, what I'm about to do now, I'm just going to pull and pour a little of the sauce in here. I've already poured some. I just wanted to come and show y'all what I was doing. I had to pour sauce. In here, like it said, now, next time y'all see me, I'm going to be getting it together to assemble the enchilada. All right, y'all, I'm back and I'm about to start assembling these uh, enchiladas. And from what I've seen on the YouTube videos, they say you don't have to use much. So that's about, that's about enough. I'm going to uh, take this meat. Since it is, since it's so thin, I'm going to use two. Well, I guess I'll just do it like this. And well, no, I'm going to put them together. They're going to be tiny. They're going to be tiny uh, enchiladas, but it's all right. I'm going to take some meat. Oh. I'm going to fill it with the meat and put a little cheese in here. And the cheese is basically just my uh, a mix of pepper jack, cheddar, uh, quesadilla, and uh, mozzarella. I'm going to roll it, make sure it gets rolled. And there you have it. I'm going to do it like that. I'm going to put it in like that. And I'm going to show you one more time. And then I'm going to come back when I have them all together. So let me just uh show you this one more time. I'm going to put it together. Oh, yeah. This, oh, this is thin. It's really thin. And don't worry, y'all. I cleaned off the... uh. I cleaned this off before I uh, started using it because, you know, like when you order your food, you have to, you got to clean off your, clean off your stuff, you know, 
when you get it. You don't know what's going on with the other people's hands. You're going to see me eat this on a walking effect on the shoes um, tonight, which tonight is Wednesday, but you're going to see this video on Friday. You're going to get this video on Friday. So, uh, yeah. Oh, shoot. Let me try this one more time. I don't know. I, maybe I'm just overstuffing it, but I know the next time I do this, I'm going to go in the store myself and get the meat because this is ridiculous. So, there you have it. I'll be right back with them all done so I can uh, put the sauce on there and the cheese on there for y'all. I'll be back. All right, y'all. I'm about to, uh, I got 12 out of the, uh, out of the package of deli meat. And so I have a lot of this ground beef left over. But don't worry, I'm not about to put all that on here. But I am going to put a generous amount. All right, guys, and here you go, the finished product of my keto enchiladas. Look at that. Don't that look good? Yeah. <laughs> y'all, I ain't know if I could pull this off, but I did, y'all. So, I'm going to go ahead on and end this video with I love you guys. Y'all take care. Be blessed. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Thank you for coming and watching and rocking with the girl. And until next time, you guys, I'm going to push it down and pull you up later. I forgot, I always remember to smile, smile, smile. I love y'all. Y'all stay safe out there, guys. Peace.